do you know what's lame? Me. I've covered the price, I've covered the packaging, I've covered its formula, I've covered how long it stays. Being a YouTuber and especially a makeup one, I keep trying new products so that I can come back and show you guys how it works. But being from an extremely sensitive and dry skin family, I cannot. So I have a lot of restrictions when I use any kind of product, be it skincare, be it makeup, be it any damn thing that I put on my face because my skin reacts. You know that I have PCOD, hence I have tons of acne popping up every morning. Hence, it can be concluded if I get a new product which is working for me and I'm super excited about it, I should be jumping and making a video, right? Well, no, that's why I'm lame. I bought this product so long back that it's almost over now. Like see, I've hit the pan almost one month back and I have still not made a video about it. So many of my friends and cousins and relatives asked me what I'm using. I have almost made five to six people buy this and they loved it. They came back to me with amazing reviews on how this product is very amazing and you can use it daily and it is so easy to use. So I love the fact that it's amazingly, amazing, amazingly easy to use. But again, I have been using it daily for last three months. I have this with me for three months. Coming to the video, I am today going to review this particular product. It is basically a makeup base which I use as a foundation and a concealer every day. If you remember this video right here, I have this stick from Color Essence which I have been in love with. I still am. It's again from Color Essence. But this is their premium range. Uh, it's an HD makeup base which is priced at 420. Sorry, it's priced at 4 95 apparently you can get it at 420 from a beauty center so they have a lot of shades uh, i actually picked up a lighter one as well i'm gonna try both and show you guys and you tell me i feel that this matches me very well though it seems very dark this matches me and whenever i'm wearing it my friends say that i've gone a little tan but the lighter one i feel is too light for me and i'm a person who would rather go for dark than light because i don't want to look like i have put makeup on my face i'm happier <laughs> looking tan or my skin tone but i don't want something light but i know a lot of girls a lot of friends who like putting on the lighter shade but that's just a personal preference so if you want it you can do it do you remember my favorite brush so why i use this brush for foundation or, or to apply the base ma make a base on my face is because it is extremely dense it's not a fluffy brush and it has this flat top which i feel makes it more easier to go through everywhere and just spread the product i think you can call it a cream foundation uh, it's not very liquidy but it's not as hard as a pan stick it is very creamy and very foundation like and as you can see I've just I'll just dab the brush like that and I'm also dabbing it just in the center so I'm not really picking up a lot of product and let's see the magic happening so this is the side of my face with a lot of acne and everything When I just dab the brush like a beauty blender and not drag it, this is how amazing the coverage is. It's like gone I'd, and it looks like my skin. I'm going to show you up close. So it looks like my skin and not some makeup that I've put on the top of it. I feel that it does dry up a little and hence I use an oil based or a face oil as my primer because you see you do you even see the glow that it's giving I like that glow and hence I use it on top of the oil this is the lighter shade brand new this is um, HDM 13 and this is HDM 16 and this is lighter so now I'll use the lighter one and show you and tell you tell me if you see a difference again all you need to do is Take the product like that very less product don't really swirl the brush in because it is going to pick up a lot of product all i do is dab it in here and let's do this side if i do the same technique and dab the product this side this is the kind of coverage it gives me now you do you see that this does cast a, a lighter shade on my face this is what i don't like this looks a little more natural to me than this 
now it works wonders on my under eye as well so i'll just go i'm just going to take the product and i'm going to start using it as a concealer on this side as well so all i do is dab 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 it's done its work so well i just love the formulation so what i wanted to show you was the difference in colors and shade i don't really stop here because the wrinkles under my eye uh, any kind of product gets settled very quickly so just to ensure that it lasts very long and looks more like my skin so if you thought that it's looking like my skin now just wait for the next step that i'm going to do so i basically take my cryolans translucent powder this is in the shade tl14 so i like to go with my brush settle the product and then try to make least amount of movement i take the translucent powder on my real techniques beauty blender and i bake the shit out of my face that powder is exactly my skin shade and oh my god the makeup does not come off even when i'm washing my face at night after keeping the makeup on for 10 12 hours so yeah that was all about that product i've covered the price i've covered the packaging i've covered its formula i've covered how long it stays it stays until you remove it it's not something that you need touch up for if you want to know anything else ask me the questions in the comments and i will answer them for you if you like my product reviews please give the video a big thumbs up so that i know that it's reaching to someone out there and it's helping people but i am going to include a clip of how it looks when everything is done and the full face of makeup is done okay i am back so i removed the baking i reviewed an eyebrow kit added lipstick and here is the final result and so everything is settled you remove the baking and all this is how your face looks with the color essence hd makeup base if you want to stay on the top of the updates so whenever i buy anything whenever i'm going for shopping i usually make insta stories so if you want to stay on top of that you can obviously follow me on instagram the handle's name is jabeen sarang until next video bye